Hello everyone, it's Janelle and today I'll be doing a top coat experiment with nail foils. We'll be testing out 5 different top coats over nail foils and see which is the best and which is the worst. The 5 top coats we'll be trying out today are Butter London's Nail 999 Rescue Top Coat, Little Ondine Secret Top Coat Base Coat, HK Girl Glisten and Glow Top Coat, Salon Perfect Top Coat, and Sesh Feet Dry Fast Top Coat. For the nail foils, I'll be applying this gold nail foil from Born Pretty Store over some fake plastic nails so you can see the top coats in action. And as for the glue, I am using Bundle Monsters Nail Foil Glue. To apply nail foils, apply a thin coat of nail glue and then wait 5 minutes until the glue is clear and tacky but not sticky. Then cut off a section of the nail foil, then with the color side up, press onto your nail, then lift off the plastic. Keep doing this until the nail is fully covered with foil. And now that I have my 5 nails all ready to go, let's get started with sesh feet. So before your very eyes, you can see that the top coat immediately starts to crack the nail foil. Here's the before and after. I'm not really sure why this happens. Next we have a top coat from Salon Perfect. This brand is from Walmart. And yet again, severe cracking. Maybe only slightly better than sesh feet, but uh, it's about the same. Next up is Little Ondine. I talked about this brand a few videos back. This top coat is water-based and has a rubbery feeling. So far, this is the only one that had no significant foil change. The fourth top coat on the list is HK Girl Glisten and Glow. We're getting a real intense crackle effect with this one. Last but not least, we have Butter London's Nail 999 Top Coat. This one destroys the foil finish as well, but another weird thing happens. Here I sped up the drying process so you can see this weird milky cast that develops at the end. Since this one changed the most, I'd have to say that this was the worst of the bunch. So let's recap. Butter London on the left crackled and removed shine. Moving to the right, HK Girl was maybe second place. Little Ondine performed the best and looks barely changed. Salon Perfect and Sesh Feet performed about the same, tied for third place. I'd say Little Ondine was the winner of this challenge and the loser was Butter London. It's too bad that Little Ondine doesn't last very long, but then again, nail foils don't last that long in general. If you use nail foils, do you use top coat? Do you have an even better top coat that works? Let me know in the comment section below. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Hey, did. Did they click like? If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. We have no thumbs. <laughs>